The Quest Kodiak 100 is a versatile single-engine turboprop aircraft, known for its rugged design and exceptional short takeoff and landing capabilities. Powered by a Pratt & Whitney PT-6A, 34 engine producing 750 shaft horsepower, it achieves a maximum cruise speed of approximately 174 knots and a range of 1,132 nautical miles. With a maximum takeoff weight of 7,255 pounds and a useful load of around 3,530 pounds, the Kodiak 100 can accommodate up to 10 occupants, including the pilot. Its spacious cabin measures 15 feet 10 inches in length, 4 feet 9 inches in height, and 4 feet 6 inches in width, offering 248 cubic feet of volume. Designed for operations on unimproved surfaces, it is ideal for accessing remote locations. Equipped with advanced Garmin G1000 avionics, the Kodiak 100 enhances situational awareness and safety. Its impressive performance, combined with a large cargo door, and an optional external cargo pod, makes it a preferred choice for missions ranging from passenger transport to cargo delivery in challenging environments. The aircraft industry's L410NG is a twin-engine, 19-seat turboprop aircraft known for its enhanced short takeoff and landing capabilities and modern advancements. Equipped with two GEH-85-200 engines, each delivering 850 horsepower, it achieves a maximum cruise speed of approximately 417 km per hour and a range of up to 2,570 km. With a maximum takeoff weight of 7,000 kg and a useful payload capacity of 2,150 kg, the L410NG features a spacious cabin measuring 15.07 m in length, 5.97 m in height, and a wingspan of 19.98 m, offering a cabin volume of 17.9 cubic meters and comfortably accommodating up to 19 passengers. Its robust design enables operations from unpaved runways, making it ideal for accessing remote locations. Equipped with state-of-the-art Garmin G3000 avionics, the aircraft enhances flight safety and crew comfort. Improvements such as increased fuel capacity due to new wing structures significantly extend its range and endurance, making the L410NG a versatile choice for various missions, from passenger transport to cargo delivery in challenging environments. The Papistrel Alpha Electro is a pioneering two-seat electric aircraft designed primarily for flight training, offering an eco-friendly alternative to traditional fuel-powered trainers. It is equipped with a 60 kilowatts, 80 horsepower, liquid-cooled electric motor, delivering efficient and quiet operation. With a wingspan of 10.5 m, a length of 6.5 m, and a height of 2.05 m, it features a wing area of 9.51 square meters. The aircraft has a maximum takeoff weight of 550 kilograms and a useful load of 182 kilograms, 401 pounds. Performance-wise, the Alpha Electro achieves a maximum cruise speed of 85 knots, 157 kilometers per hour, and a stall speed of 38 knots with flaps extended. It boasts an impressive rate of climb at 1,220 feet per minute and a service ceiling of 12,800 feet. Its endurance is up to 60 minutes plus reserve, making it ideal for short training flights. Notably, its electric propulsion results in significantly lower operating costs, with energy expenses as low as a few euros per hour. Additionally, the Alpha Electro features excellent short field performance with a takeoff distance of just 140 meters and the ability to recuperate energy during approaches, enhancing overall efficiency. The Boeing YC-14 was an experimental twin-engine tactical military transport aircraft developed in the 1970s as part of the U.S. Air Force's Advanced Medium Estilo Transport AMSD program, aiming to replace the Lockheed C-130 Hercules. Featuring a high-wing design, 
with a wingspan of 39.32m and a length of 40.13m. The YC-14 utilized an innovative upper surface blowing technique to enhance its short takeoff and landing capabilities. This design positioned two General Electric CF6-50D turbofan engines, each producing 24.6 knots of thrust above the wings, directing exhaust over the upper surface to increase lift. The aircraft had a maximum takeoff weight of 113,852 kilograms and could transport payloads up to 36,740 kilograms. It achieved a maximum speed of 810 kilometers per hour, a cruising speed of 723 kilometers per hour, and a range of 4,815 kilometers. Despite successful test flights demonstrating its advanced stall performance, the AMSD program was canceled in 1979, and the YC-14 did not enter production. One prototype is displayed at the Pima Air and Space Museum in Tucson, Arizona, while the other is stored at davis monthan Air Force Base. The Piper PA-18 Super Cub is a legendary two-seat, single-engine aircraft renowned for its exceptional short takeoff and landing capabilities, making it a favorite among bush pilots and flight schools. Introduced in 1949, it evolved from the earlier Piper J3 Cub and PA-11 models. The Super Cub features a high-wing design with a wingspan of 10.76m and a length of 6.91m. Various engine configurations were available, with the most common being the 150 horsepower, like homing 0320, enabling a maximum speed of approximately 130 miles per hour and a cruising speed of around 100 miles per hour. Its stall speed is notably low at around 43 miles per hour, contributing to its remarkable SDLL performance. The aircraft's empty weight is approximately 930 pounds with a maximum takeoff weight of 1,750 pounds, 794 kilograms, allowing for a useful load of about 820 pounds. Fuel capacity varies, with standard tanks holding 36 gallons, providing a range of approximately 460 miles. The Super Cub's robust design, combined with its impressive performance, has cemented its status as an iconic and versatile aircraft in aviation history. The Zenith Stoll CH-750 is a light sport utility aircraft renowned for its exceptional short takeoff and landing capabilities. Featuring a wingspan of 29 feet 10 inches and a wing area of 144 square feet, the CH-750 measures 21 feet 10 inches in length with a horizontal tail span of 8 feet 5 inches. With an empty weight of approximately 775 pounds, it supports a design gross weight of 1,440 pounds and a useful load of 545 pounds under light sport aircraft regulations. The cabin offers a standard width of 42 in, expandable to 50 in with optional bubble doors for enhanced pilot and passenger comfort. Performance-wise, the CH-750 achieves a maximum cruise speed of 100 miles per hour, stalls at 35 miles per hour, and boasts a rate of climb of 1,000 feet per minute. Its impressive SDLL performance allows for takeoff rolls of just 100 feet and landing rolls of 25 feet with a fuel capacity of 24 gallons. The aircraft offers a range of approximately 440 miles and an endurance of 4.4 hours making it a versatile choice for both recreational pilots and those requiring reliable short field performance. The Kodiak 900 is an advanced single-engine turboprop aircraft designed for versatility and performance. Measuring 37.7 feet in length and 15.7 feet in height, it features a 45-foot wingspan and is powered by a Pratt & Whitney Canada PT-6A, 140A engine producing 900 horsepower. The aircraft achieves a maximum cruise speed of 210 knots true airspeed and has a range of 1,129 nautical miles. With a maximum takeoff weight of 8,000 pounds, 
and a useful load of 3,630 pounds. The Kodiak 900 offers a spacious cabin accommodating up to nine passengers, providing flexibility for various missions. Equipped with the Garmin G1000 Inchi Avionics Suite, it ensures advanced navigation and safety features. Its short takeoff and landing capabilities, combined with rugged construction, make it ideal for operations from unimproved airstrips. The de Havilland Canada DHC-2 Beaver is a renowned single-engine, high-wing SDOL aircraft celebrated for its versatility in bush flying and utility roles. Measuring 30 feet 3 inches in length with a wingspan of 48 feet, it offers a spacious cabin accommodating up to eight occupants. Powered by a 450-horsepower Pratt & Whitney R-985 Wasp Jr. radial engine, the Beaver achieves a maximum cruise speed of approximately 122 miles per hour and a range of up to 800 miles. Its robust design supports a maximum takeoff weight of 5,100 pounds, enabling a useful load capacity of around 2,100 pounds. The aircraft's exceptional short takeoff and landing capabilities, combined with its adaptability to various terrains and configurations such as wheels, skis, or floats, have solidified its status as an iconic workhorse in aviation history. The Zlin Savage Cub is a light sport aircraft inspired by the classic Piper Cub, renowned for its short takeoff and landing capabilities. Measuring 6.39 m in length with a wingspan of 9.31 m, it features a welded steel tube fuselage and aluminum wings covered in aircraft fabric. Powered by a 75 kilowatts, 100 horsepower, Rotax 912 ULS four-cylinder horizontally opposed liquid and air-cooled engine, the Savage Cub achieves a maximum speed of 165 km per hour and a stall speed of 52 km per hour. With a maximum takeoff weight of 472.5 kg, it accommodates two occupants in a tandem seating arrangement. Its robust design and SDLL performance make it suitable for operations from unimproved airstrips, appealing to bush pilots and recreational aviators alike. The Britain Norman BN2 Islander is a versatile twin-engine light utility aircraft, renowned for its short takeoff and landing capabilities. Measuring 35 feet 9 inches in length with a wingspan of 49 feet 6 inches, it accommodates up to nine passengers, or a combination of passengers and cargo. The Islander is powered by two Lycoming O540 E4C5 engines, each producing 260 horsepower enabling a maximum cruise speed of approximately 170 miles per hour, 150 knots, and a range of around 620 miles, 540 nautical miles. With a maximum takeoff weight of 6,600 pounds, its robust design and fixed tricycle landing gear allow operations from unprepared airstrips, making it ideal for inter-island transport, regional commuting, and utility missions. Its enduring production since 1965, with over 1,300 units built, underscores its reliability and adaptability in various operating conditions. The Pilatus PC-6 Porter is a renowned single-engine utility aircraft celebrated for its exceptional short takeoff and landing capabilities. Measuring 11 m in length with a wingspan of 15.87 m, its high wing design enhances SDLL performance. Powered by a Pratt & Whitney Canada PT6A 27 turboprop engine, producing 550 horsepower, the PC-6 achieves a maximum cruise speed of approximately 232 km per hour and a range of up to 1,500 km. With a maximum takeoff weight of 2,800 kilograms, it allows for a useful load of around 1,200 kilograms. Its spacious cabin accommodates up to 10 passengers or various cargo configurations, making it highly versatile for missions such as passenger transport, 
cargo delivery, and aerial survey operations. The PCSAXS rugged construction and ability to operate from unprepared airstrips have solidified its reputation as a reliable workhorse in challenging environments worldwide. The Cessna 208 Caravan is a versatile single-engine turboprop aircraft renowned for its reliability and adaptability across various missions. Measuring 37 feet 7 inches in length with a wingspan of 52 feet 1 inch, it features a high-wing design that enhances stability and provides excellent visibility. Powered by a 675-horsepower Pratt and Whitney PT-6A, 114A engine, the caravan achieves a maximum cruise speed of approximately 186 knots, 344 kilometers per hour, and a range of up to 1,070 nautical miles, 1,982 kilometers. Its unpressurized cabin typically seats nine passengers, with configurations accommodating up to 14, and offers a maximum useful load of around 3,350 pounds. The aircraft's fixed tricycle landing gear and robust construction enable operations from short and unimproved airstrips, making it ideal for passenger transport, cargo delivery, and special missions such as skydiving and medical evacuations. Since its introduction in 1984, over 3,000 units have been produced, underscoring its enduring popularity and operational success. The Aurora Liberty Lifter is an innovative seaplane concept developed under DARPA's Liberty Lifter program, aiming to revolutionize heavy lift capabilities from the sea. This high-wing monohull design boasts a wingspan of 65 meters and is engineered to carry up to 50,000 pounds of cargo. It operates efficiently in ground effect close to the ocean's surface and can reach altitudes up to 3,000 meters. The Liberty Lifter is designed to take off and land in Sea State 4 conditions and sustain on water operations up to Sea State 5, enabling it to function in moderate to rough sea states. Its robust and adaptive control system is tailored for operations around waves and obstacles, enhancing its versatility for missions such as fast logistics, search and rescue, and disaster response. By combining the heavy lift capacity of a ship with the speed of an aircraft, the Liberty Lifter represents a significant advancement in sea-based transport systems. The Mall M-7 is a versatile single-engine high-wing aircraft, renowned for its exceptional short takeoff and landing capabilities. Measuring 23.3 feet in length with a wingspan of 32.9 feet, the M-7 Seven features a robust steel tubular frame with fabric covering and metal wings. Powered by a 235 horsepower Lycoming 0540 B4B5 engine, it achieves a top cruise speed of 137 knots and a stall speed of 35 knots. The aircraft's maximum takeoff weight is 2,500 pounds, offering a useful load capacity of approximately 1,000 pounds. Its spacious cabin accommodates up to four passengers plus one pilot, with a large cargo area of around 38 cubic feet. The M7's SDLL performance allows for takeoff distances as short as 125 feet and landing distances over a 50-foot obstacle of 600 feet with a fuel capacity of 40 gallons. It offers a range of approximately 800 nautical miles. The M7's adaptability to various terrains and configurations, including optional tricycle or tailwheel undercarriage and floatplane setups, makes it ideal for bush flying, law enforcement, and recreational aviation.